In this video, I will show you how to do Halloween just to wait in offer of X. First, I will create a new comb and rename it as test. Using type tool, I will type a test. Go to test layer, animate, opacity. Set a keyframe for opacity at the beginning of the timeline. Under rain selector, set a keyframe for offset at the beginning of the timeline. Let me go 3 seconds and change it back to 100. I will create a new comb by dragging this test comb to this comb icon right here and rename it as test animation. Let me create a new solid and rename it as background. I will drag the solid layer at bottom. Go to effects and presets and type fill. Drag this into background layer. I will change the color to red. Let me create another solid and rename it as turbulent noise. I will drag this in between these two layers. Change the blend mode to overlay. Go to effects and presets and under noise and grain. Drag this turbulent noise into this turbulent noise solid layer. Change contrast to 80. Brightness to 30. And transform scale to Hold Alt key on keyboard and click on the stopwatch icon. Now we are going to add an expression. Time multiply 100. Go to effects and presets under generate fill. Drag this into test comb. Change the red color to black. Go to effects and presets under stylize roughen edges. Change edge type to spiky. Border to 3, scale to 30, complexity to 3. Create a copy of the test comb by pressing Ctrl plus D. Change the border to 20. Scale to 75, complexity to 5. I will create a copy of this turbulent noise and rename it as turbulent title. Go to effects and presets, noise and grain, turbulent noise, drag this into turbulent title. Change contrast to 400, complexity to 10. Hold Alt key on keyboard and click on the evolution stopwatch icon. We are going to add an expression time multiply 300. Now we are going to hide the turbulent title layer. Go to effects of presets under channel set mat. Drag this into top test scope. Under set mat, change track mat from layer to turbulent title. And source to effects and mask. Check on invert mat. Create another copy of the test scope. Delete the rough edges. Go to effects and presets under blur and sharpen Gaussian blur. Drag this into top test scope. Place the Gaussian blur above the set mat. Change blurriness to 175. Create a new solid or rename it as turbulent noise. Go to effects and presets and add turbulent noise to the turbulent noise solid layer. Change blend mode to multiply. Change fractal type to turbulent sharp. Noise type to linear. Contrast to 640. Brightness to minus 54. Scale to 50. Add an expression to evolution. Posterize time. Open bracket 8. Close bracket semicolon. Time multiply 400. Create another copy of solid layer. Change contrast to 850. Scale to 100. Change the expression to time multiply 200. Add another copy of solid layer. Change scale to 450. Create a new adjustment layer. Add noise and gray. Noise. Drag this into adjustment layer. Change amount of noise to 10. And uncheck the use color noise. Again, go to effects and presets under stylized vignette. Drag this into adjustment layer. Effects and presets under color correction, brightness and contrast. Create expression for brightness. Random open bracket minus 2, comma 5, close bracket. I will copy this expression and paste it into contrast.
go to this bottom desktop and add turbulent displays CC mo to 30 create a expression for evolution time multiply 30 copy this turbulent display effect and paste it into other tutor scope and that's it people